We had a great outfield deke in game one of the American League Championship Series. Watch this. Pause right here. Winker's throwing on the brakes. Where is Kike throwing the ball to? Well, here's what's going on. There's two options. One, he's going to come up firing to third base. In that case, Winker goes back to second, and we're all good. The other option, he kind of lazily throws it to second, stopping the runner on first from getting a second, but Winker gets third. It's a blowout. Those are the two things. Well, it looks like he's going to third, so Winker stops, but he actually does that crazy no-look throw behind Winker. He goes to third. He's hung up. Goodbye. That's pro baseball. Jake, a lot of pro baseball to be played yet. Jim, Zach, sports and baseball hot in the street. The big markets are here. New York, LA, New York again. Yankees, Mets, Dodgers, and Cleveland as we tee off the ALCS. And we're kind of on the business side now and we can give you the whole like it's good for sports and you're going to do the whole some of the small market people are like, ah, it's, it's not that. Who cares about big markets? Everyone. Everyone. Ratings are going through the roof. Bobby Knight just tweeted 33% up or something like that. Which Bobby Knight? Bobby Nightingale. Bobby Knight, the historic head coach. Dead. Throw my chair at you. Here's the situation. I was reading uh, uh, an article. I think it was from MLB.com about the four scenarios for the World Series and which ones are the best. And they had Yankees-Dodgers as the number one. Judge versus Otani. Yeah, the both two markets, cities. Both yeah. coasts. That's clearly the number one. Then I thought it was interesting which one would be number two. The Subway Series, but you kind of lose the, the left coast there. Because Otani with the Dodgers Tony's big versus Cleveland might do more for views all over the country and all over the world yeah. than Mets Yankee subway series. What are your thoughts? I think two things can be true. I think the Dodger guardians numbers would technically be bigger around the world. I think for baseball in the States, which it's still like rooted in, I think a subway series would be voluptuous. Good luck. Yeah, this is a I'm a I'm a Nikki Cash character. Ishkabo. What was this almost a breakdown you were telling the people about? Everybody's favorite new quarterback, Will Levis. Three, two, one, three two, and a half. It's two. a little confusing. Yeah, it says Levi's, it, Levis. Is it really Levis? Levis, yeah. Sounds like a mistake. Um he was running out of bounds. Got pushed right before he went out of bounds. Tried to extend his arm to get the extra yard, and that kind of Got him off kilter. Goes tumbling into the sideline. Like front tabletops, the ball boy, who I think is a ball man. Front yeah. tabletops, always hilarious because you should see it coming. The guy got seriously hurt. He got like carted off and people are giving Will crapola because he didn't help the ball man up. I don't really put it against him, but he could have helped him. Yeah, this was tough because uh, Will Levis has a target right now because he's the new turnover quarterback. He had a couple comically bad ones early on. I think it's great entertainment. Like, there was a time when Ryan Fitzpatrick, Fitzmagic, he was the interception guy, Jameis for a little bit. Will Levis is pushing the limits on this. I was shocked to see people were mad at him. He's playing football, and he does get, like, pushed. And, like, the ball man's, one of his job is to watch out for people coming at him. So And he was running fast. Be more mad at the guy that pushed him out of bounds. And Will Levis, like, still has to go and quarterback the team. So it's not like, what's he just going to stand over him and be sad? I did hear he paid all his medical bills, though. Did you hear that? Nope. Didn't hear. That was, I was a lie. Say, I didn't think you Made heard that. Made that up the second you heard it. Go, 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 go. Back. To the more sports. But first, there's a chill in the air and the leaves are falling to the ground. I'm allergic to them and I've been sneezing a ton. But you know what I'm not allergic to? Bonus bets. And you guys can bet just $5 and you'll instantly get 200 in bonus bets when you use code DUMB. Look at Jake's face. Make a dumb face. Dumb. So download the DraftKings Sportsbook app now. New customers use promo code yeah, DUMB yeah, yeah, and bet just $5 on any wager and get 200 in bonus bets instantly. That's promo code DUMB only at DraftKings Sportsbook. Probably put the whole of my bank account on Soto hitting a first inning homer off Cobb tonight. Did it this happen? Comes out. Home run by Soto. Jim and more sports. Houston area high school football players punished after using belts to spank players on the team they beat 77 uh, nothing. You know, sometimes we make jokes on this show. People may have missed it, but this is pretty bad, man. Now, Come on. let's give a warning to the people. You and I read the headline, watched the videos, didn't read anything else. Correct. There might have been some good insight in the article. But we did watch this man talk. Spank the other team. The viral video 
upsetting a lot of people. And then we paused it and laughed and said, let's do that story and didn't watch the rest of that video either. So there's a lot of context we might not be having. I'm surprised at the level of buy-in from the team. They won 77 nothing, And there was yeah. like five of them with their belts out spanking the other team. Yeah, and the handshake line, good game, spank with the belt. Because we just spanked That's you. just always been a known no. <clears throat> Jim, tell them about this not sports video. You were heavily involved in this. This not sports video is a nightmare. <laughs> yeah. Bye her own doing so this woman remains unnamed and good for her she's been feeding the local raccoons for 35 years mm -hmm. but she told deputies the situation escalated six weeks ago and now she's got an army of raccoons in her yard like too many are raccoons in one yard and then there's a cop standing there just like patrolling it like what's that guy doing oh he was doing nothing you see it in the video but he's standing close i wouldn't want to stand close to all those raccoons yeah i mean he's trying to prove he's an alpha but yeah no you're in a situation there with the raccoon raccoons turn on you you could lose for sure the woman says the raccoons often surround her day and night demanding food yeah, yeah. unnamed woman you fed them for 35 years they're trash pandas that's what people call them. Dude, there's a couple things. You mentioned we don't know how to say the name of the town, Pullsbo. And the county Fire sheriff's bear. department is Kitsap? Kitsap. Why is none of this real? What happened? Kitsap County. It's too many raccoons. And you can see that in the early instant images. Northwest founded by lunatics. There's new land. You got to go on Oregon Trail. Everyone dies. $500. I'll go. That's who founded it. $500 per raccoon to trap and relocate them. Again, I'm a pretty big animal guy. Yeah. Why aren't we just... Um, Why are we relocating the raccoons? I don't know. And I'm like, I'm an animal guy. Are they big for the ecosystem at this point? Like probably somewhere. But I had a raccoon in, uh, going through my trash once. I bought new trash cans. I had lids and bricks. Fuck that raccoon. It's a good feeling. What do you got now, raccoon? No thumbs. Fuck raccoons, dude. Do they have thumbs? Got little hands. That was so cute. Wish that was on camera. Wish I was on camera. So I'll do an impression of Zach. Little hands. <laughs> little hands. Are you mad at me for wanting to kill the raccoons? Oh. Do you have dreams about getting bit by animals? Sometimes. I have it all the time. If there's dream doctors out there, Ooh. let me know what's coming my way. I mean, nonstop, I'm just t getting like latched onto in my dreams and playing tug of war. You ever have your teeth fall out? Yes. I don't anymore, but I went through that like two years ago. It was bad. Jake just dreams about sucking himself off. All right. See you guys. That was a weekly day. That was a secret dream that I had one time every night. <laughs> <laughs>